In 2022, God showed his faithfulness to us in many ways. As a church, he was our comfort and refuge in tough times, our friend when we needed one, and the amazing God we could look to for hope for the future. He brought us back together even when it once felt impossible. When this year began, however, we knew it was going to be different from before. When the year first started, um, we all had tons of questions like, um, can I trust God to go back to church? Am I worthy enough to go back to church? Am I good enough for church again? For all the stuff that I've experienced and gone through and faced during the pandemic, am I still qualified to be used by God? And I think the most pertinent was, is church still home? We had no idea what to expect. We weren't allowed to be together. There were so many rules that just, you know, kept changing. And in a way, we kind of had to rediscover church. However, that didn't stop us. Despite the challenges, we got back together. We walked with one another, started whole new chapters in our lives, served the communities, and rediscovered what it means to be church. In 2022, we walked with one another. We not only grew in numbers, but we grew deeper in our relationship with God. For some of us, this year required a leap of faith, whether it was meeting again face to face, trusting God with our finances, or allowing Him to work in our relationships. We empowered the next generation. We serve the community. He has truly expressed His love and faithfulness to us this year. And one exciting example is that we got to start a lot of new chapters in the form of new connections, a fresh start, and even a whole new chapter for our church. We began the groundwork uh, in San Pedro way back uh, 2017, no? and uh, we've been doing that until the pandemic hit. So, kailangan natin magpos. And when we wanted to go to come back as well, 2022, uh, medyo mahirap at challenging kasi naghanap tayo ng lugar where we can gather people and do discipleship. And we initially uh, gathered people okay, in La Fe uh, Garden. It's an outdoor place where we do our Sunday services. Grabe, laking blessing nun. And while we were there, we were believing in God for a new place. And uh, talagang naganap tayo doon. Eventually, we got one okay, in the Rocks Corporate Center. But before we transferred, uh, nag average tayo ng mga 120 people in attendance. Pero right after we moved, we saw yung number growing, double, and eventually hit the 300 people. Pero ang exciting part, it's not just the number, pero we are more excited to see family or families, especially young couples, na ma-raise natin and be empowered in San Pedro. After a season of contraction, we're believing in God for a season of great expansion. The year was full of ups and downs, yet God has been with us through it all. 2022 was not perfect, but we believe God has started restoring and we have begun rebuilding from the struggles these past few years. And in 2023, we're believing for even more. We're believing for miracles.